Does John want red or brown sauce on his? Uh, brown, I think he didn't say. Who we doing food tonight? I don't know what. Oh, yeah, because nothing says party like a table full of sandwiches. <laughs> Eve, how about it? Do you fancy it? House on the pot? Oh, I don't know. You can't even manage cheese and pineapple on sticks. Sure. Rustle up a bag of nuts if you're lucky. Um, three teas. We've got a minute, then. Thank you. What about you three? Do you fancy it? Party tonight? You know me and Andy are moving in together. I had heard a rumour. Yeah. Um, I don't know what I'm doing yet. I'm supposed to be coming out, so... Well, if you change your mind, it starts about seven. OK. Thanks. Why are you playing it cool? Yeah, it could be a chance to sort things out. Yeah, maybe there's nothing to sort out, eh? It's not my fault I've already made plans, is it? OK. <clears throat> All right, Maisie. Hi. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. How's the new house? Have you settled in all right? Yeah, yeah, it seems, seems OK. Good. We're having a, a party tonight, if you fancy it. I'm working. Sorry. Oh, well, maybe you could come by later or something. Um, yeah, maybe. Uh, Will's back from his trip, so if you want to pop up to the house any time... Then... I'd love to. Yeah, uh, why don't I give your mum a ring and see, see when's best? Yeah, OK. Good. I'll take my eye off you for one second. Is it just blonde you're obsessed with, or you're not that fussy? Oh, no, 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 no. She's, she's my sister. Well, she's my half-sister, technically. But it's kind of complicated. I'll see you later. Yeah, uh-huh. Who you've got mascara all over your face? You look like Amy Winehouse, you Stop that. Well, you're going to need a mirror. Bathroom's upstairs. Oh, Did you get a hand with anything? Oh, hi. Uh, no, fine, thanks. Oh, good. I said that. Oh. Give us it here. Oh, look, there's all the seats we're glued in on. Told you. Now, Jamie, big butch, get that open for us, look. Katie, not coming? Uh, uh, no, she's. Uh... She had a better offer. Must be hard for you know being so popular. <laughs> they went up thousands of pounds in debts and then just bailed them when the game got tough. You just walked out on you? Yeah, left me right in it. That's why I ended up at my hands. Believe me, it wasn't the team biscuits with the vicar that attracted me. Anyway, don't be listening to me and my sub stories. We've all got murky paths, haven't we? Not me, darling. Pure as the driven snow. Yeah, right. I know it's like the first time I met you. <laughs> How's it being led astray? Oh, well, you reckon you're the woman for the job, do you? Um, did your date finish early, then? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it did. Um, do you know what? I'm, I'm just going to go... I think you better take some of these down to the bottle bank. Put will have a fit if I leave them out in the back. Get a shower again. Did you lock the door this time? Oh, we're having a party? Didn't realise you. Smooth, Andy. Oh, shut up. Who said he'd fall asleep in the chair? Yeah, well, needs must. Even if someone was trying pretty hard to wake you up as well. Persistent, isn't she? I thought she was on a promise to tell you was a whole sparkle. <laughs> yeah, I just figured it wasn't worth the hassle. Well, Kate had already clocked you. And what do you think my chances are of talking my way out of that one? <laughs> Absolute zilch. Yep, I had a feeling you might say that. All right. Fine. You? Bob? Hello? Kate, about last night, I'm really sorry. I, I didn't mean to upset you. Ryan, you can do what you want. You're a free agent, right? Yeah. Yeah, I am. So why all the attitude? What attitude? <laughs> but you've, you've made it perfectly clear that you don't want to be with me anymore, so what, what am I supposed to do? Just hang around and wait for you to change your mind? Oops. Sorry. Bad timing. Well, it looks like you two have a lot to talk about. I'll be through there if you need me. Do you know what? You're right. 
It's none of my business what you do or who with. You and me were never going to work out. Could have given it a damn good go, though, eh? Ryan, I've wasted too much time on blokes that aren't right for me. I think we should just let this one go. Yeah, I think you're right. That was way out of your league, anyway. <laughs> yeah, that'll be it. The only stumbling block. <laughs> I'll see you around, OK? See you. But do yourself a favour. Cast your net a little bit wider. You can do better than her. Good job I'm tougher than I look. Otherwise, I could get pretty upset about you still being hung up in your ex and using me to make her jealous. Well, that's not what I was doing at all. Oh, come on, Ryan. Maybe not consciously. I saw you arguing with her earlier. Still something there. No, there's, there's really not. <laughs> Even I'm being serious. Katie's made her feelings very clear. We're not. Oh, so she's the one calling the shots. Do you like it when girls make you work for it? <laughs> I'm, I'm not looking for anything complicated. Oh, don't worry about it. You weren't being offered anything complicated. I thought you wouldn't have been to the shop for me. Oh, sorry, Nan. I'll be two minutes. Duty calls. Let me know how you get on with your plans. See ya. Honestly, I thought the whole place was going to go up. Well, he actually chucked a glass at it. Yeah, I missed him by about that much. Why do we always miss the best bits? <laughs> oh, ding, ding. Looks like it could be round two. Oh, I didn't recognise that. His tongue stuck down Eve's throat. All right, mate. Hi, what can I get you? Just an orange juice, please. A pint of lager for me. How are the dog? Mm. Uh, I'll get these guys. No hard feelings, hey? Thanks. 